Alright beautiful people, how are you? Um, how are you? Alright guys, so I had to move to the back. It's not good to carry a baby while sitting in the front seat. It's against the road safety law. So look at baby here, it's busy. Oh, don't put your hand inside your eye now, my love. My love. Speaking his hands. <laughs> Keeping himself company. Alright guys, so we are going for anti- no, we are going for immunization. <laughs> you are still referring back to when you were pregnant. I'm used to antenata. So I'm going for immunization. Like the journey continues after pregnancy. The other day I was even telling my sister which one is it, which one is even better. Is it postnatal or prenatal or like I don't even know. Postnatal is better because you're seeing what. You're what carrying. you labored for, you say what you labored for, what you're carrying. It's true. But in that you're not seeing. So you actually don't know. No, in terms of the stress. Okay, but in that stress is still. Now I'm looking at like in terms of the sleepless nights, the okay. that the carry you you saw that yesterday. Now only <laughs> it's not even up to one hour that you carried baby. <laughs> you were already tired. It's not easy, but at least we women, God has given us the grace to do it, and also with little help here and there. All right, guys, so we are heading to the hospital now. See ya. Got back from the hospital. My face is still very very rough. My hair, we need to lose it too. This is not how it will be. <laughs> so I just came back from the hospital. Baby, why are you? Sweet. Sweetie, sweetie. Sweetie, let me remove your poop now. Oh, sorry, don't cry now. Don't cry, my baby. Sorry. Look at your baby go. Mm, 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 mm. My tummy is good. Hey, gradually becoming amage. Amage feeling funky. Hey, hey, hey. Amage feeling funky. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> ah, I thank God though. I'm gradually coming back. Coming back. Coming back. And I'm happy. So guys, I just finished recording as you can see, my ring light is still here. Oh, my book is here. Oh my God, this room is so unkept. Let me take the ring light outside, I'm coming. Uh, uh, not recovered though. Uh, see, having serious body pain. So guys, my son is awake. My love. My love. It's okay. It's okay. Come. Mm. Mm. My sweet baby. My sweet baby. Oh. Mm. Mm. Stomach will not allow you, bro. Stomach will not allow my baby. Oh. So why not you worry me myself now? Huh? Worry me now. Huh? So guys, now that my son is asleep, I want to see if I can sleep as well. My sleeping beauty. With this guy, Avi Ekebe Super. Eke, 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 Ekebe Super. If I wake him now, hear me. It's just that. I'm not feeling too well, so this evening I'm even planning on, you know, going to the hospital to see how it goes from there. So my son is sleeping. He sleep and wake, sleep and wake. You know how it is now. I said their their intestines are loosening and all that. That's how it to be disturbing him. But some women said their children don't experience it too. 
like my good neighbor that have been coming to help me you know beat my son she said her children they don't experience it i was like wow wow but i know that it's not so common with uh, you know female children but when it comes to boys that is very common with boys he did my first son and now this is my son too okay I don't wake up please <laughs> I want to look for <laughs> I want to look for where I sleep you my love my love you want to wake your stomach has started again my daddy my daddy my daddy So guys, this is what we do every day. Sleep for some minutes, wake up, sleep again, wake up. The stomach will not even allow him to sleep. Him to sleep. Please, if you know anything that I can use, please just let me know in the comment section. I don't know when this stomach pain will stop. Whether it will be up to two months or so annoying, you know, watching your little child go through pains, it's really, really annoying. Sometimes I wish, <laughs> I wish I'm the one you're know, going through that stomach ache or oh, like giving me service. Not easy for me. Oh guys it's not easy <laughs> it's looking at my mouth <laughs> so what is this woman saying so my husband helps once in a while you know nigerian work now <laughs> nigerian work six to six so sometimes you need to leave very early so he helped i also have um someone here that is assisting me at home but you know now the baby's still tender i can't just i'll give out my newborn like that the baby's still tender so for now he needs care like full attention full care can't even count the number of times i wash my hands a day oh my god there's a school here so sorry for the noise hey Hey, 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 let me not complain because I'm always complaining. <laughs> let me not even complain today, but guys, it's not easy. Oh. This school here now, mm, I'm not going to complain, but I want to complain. <laughs> oh, I just want to let you know so that you bear with me. Mm, it's not my intentions. I'm not happy that there's so much noise, but what would I do? There's a school just um, behind my window here. Daytime, it's cool. In the evening, they rent out the place for church. <laughs> Nothing like rest here. Oh. In this compound, no rest. Our compound is very quiet. Our compound is as quiet as a graveyard. Very quiet. Especially when children go to school. In fact, even when they're around, you don't know. But the surroundings, guys. The surroundings is something else. So that is the update. To my baby is growing perfectly well. When we even went to the hospital, one not even. <laughs> she was even mistaking him for a six weeks birthday. Uh, for a six weeks baby. I said, no, it's just two weeks. And she was like, whoa. Wow, this boy will be a tall boy. <laughs> his mom is tall, his dad is tall, and both families, we are very tall people. So what do you expect? If he wants to even gather all the height there, eh? <laughs> that one is Iroko. Iroko tree, but you should not gather, eh? You should not gather up. So guys, that's just it. My Yuri Yuri boy. Let's go and sleep, hmm? Ah, I even have some things I sent in the kitchen. You know. mm. Go without your mom. Hey, hey, hey. It's not, it can never be the same. It can never be the same at all. 
I remember when I gave birth to my first son, all I just need to do is breastfeed. Once I finish breastfeeding, my mother would just carry her grandchild and be playing with her grandchild. My mother-in-law is supposed to come, but my sister-in-law also put to bed and her own service even through CS. So she's attending to her. But I thank God, just like I told you guys, that I have a good neighbor who is more like a mother who has showed me motherly love. She's been here beating my baby. It's just, I think yesterday that I said that oh, this woman has cried now. At least the circumcision is a goner. The, um, the novel is a goner. <laughs> so my baby is okay now. Like nothing to disturb him again. The novel has dropped. The circumcision. The pain is gone. The place has healed. So no need let me just you know and it's also handy now it's not small like that is very very handy so let me just leave this woman she's a very busy person and all that i was planning to even call her and thank her and then tell her that she should not worry my dear i now forgot so she was like oh. i was supposed to tell her now that i started taking care of the baby and all and all so that just basically it will move well without your mother around it's not funny it's not funny you guys it's not funny at all but yeah god has been faithful my husband is super supportive i have someone that's staying with me that's also helpful and then my neighbor that has played a motherly role comes to bat my son in the morning and also at night so i'm super grateful to god for that you know coaching from a professional you know a mother even if you feel you know but coaching from a mother is very very necessary <laughs> all right guys in fact these people they want to do this video with me so let me just end it here thank you so much for watching thank you so much i'm so sorry for the background noise i cannot promise you that i work on it because as it stands i don't know what to do unless we pack out of this house but hopefully god will do something yes god will do something guys what will god do <laughs> hey will god pursue them from there that's their business now that's their means of livelihood so i don't even know what god is going to do so it's just me that god will do something for so that i can leave this place yes so a better place yeah all right guys thank you so super much for watching stay beautiful and bye